Yup, that's us. You're probably wondering how we got into this situation. Yeah, early morning. Hard at work. Hmm. We survived it though. Let's tell you how it went. The simple things are with blessings, with blessings. So guys, let me start the story. Yeah, so it was convention week and hold on. Yes guys, so we look a bit dark also. Alright, so yes, I'm still attired for church. And it's the morning after. Right. So it was convention in Kingston at Philip Road. And the last night of the convention, no one we're saying we went Sunday, we went um Tuesday, face to face. And we want to reach last night face to face, although we know Jose has work. So we say, we will get ready and go. But we wonder how it's going to work out after because I don't want to drive. Because if I drive, it means that I'm going to have to drive back over to our house alone with Janine in the night. And it's not free. I'm afraid, I'm afraid. I just look at wisdom. You know, sometimes I have to use wisdom. So it's so dark, guys. Anyway, so we decide we get ready. He was asleep because he had already worked the night shift and he was asleep. When he woke up, so I was well ready to go to church. And we don't know where we reach home. I'm going there. Nobody can stop me. Ooh, I'm going there. Don't you want to go to? I'm going there. So we say if it means that we have to go sleep in his car at work, and we're going to try it, you know? Guys, went to church and apparently they were having some issues because he should have started work at 6 in the evening to 6 in the morning, right? So, we now went to church and after, I don't remember what time it was, they were calling him because they were having issues on the line and stuff. So, he had to go. So, we chop chop behind him in the car. Guys, we were stuck outside the gates because they're not going to let us in. So, we just out there in the dark. You know, security out there still, but not beside us. But they were there in our sight, you know. Anyways, after like a one-two explanation and so, he went in and solved the problem and came back and asked him, you know, little help. So they allowed us at a little front part there, so, right? We still can't come out of the vehicle, so we are stuck in there. We're not fighting because we reach work and get what needs to be done, done. So, you know, he's tired, you know. All right. We are there sitting down trying to entertain ourselves. We continued in the service online. And you might wonder, okay, so why you didn't even bother driving? Because we want to be in church face to face. You see, from COVID, we realize the zeal for being in church is not there anymore. No? So people are more to choose going online because it's online. Yes, it's being streamed online. But once we are able to go, guys, we are going to go. You understand? Soon come back. Hold on, hold on. It's Jeeps. So we're sitting out there now and... He had to go back inside, you know. And I'm thinking to myself, no, no, I need to talk to our folks about this. You see, many times you see people in their beds sleeping, and others have to be out toiling through the night. Hmm? But this name heights by great men, rich and kept, you know. And that's why enough of bad mind people, you know. Because sometimes people are there trying to enjoy the little life that God has loaned to them. And every time they try to do something, you know, there is somebody there with the negative naysayers. And you don't know what people go through to earn the little that they earn and try to enjoy what they enjoy. You know, it's something we need to stop. Don't, don't judge people like And don't talk about people and don't try to bad my people. It's not cute. You know, you know so we're out there in the halls and we're watching the time. Janine, she fall asleep a long time. I'm glad to call, you know. You're making yourself comfortable. Your vehicle's passing also. You're making yourself comfortable out there. But I just thought of the people who toiled through the night. And we were there. Anna. And, you know, another time again, he came. I call him again. You know, he had to go back in. In the hours. Fast asleep. But that's just how some of us earn our bread, you know. And we know, because of our desire to go to church, we're stuck in the car. 
But we survived. Look at us. We don't feel any way because we wanted to be a church. So here we are. And he's not going to talk to you now because he's just tired. And we understand. We're home, guys. I'm tired.